David Wagner again, designer and creator of Gyro HPH, which stands for Human Powered Helicopter. Continue on in our discussion. Um, there are certain things with regards to my prop wing which I've designed which we really won't know for sure how it's going to handle and what's going to take place until we actually get uh, the craft built or our prototype built um, on a smaller scale to test it. But essentially what we have is some other conditions that we have to consider with regards to how we have designed the craft and what we're looking at. And um, it's an articulated rotor design, okay? Now, let me try to explain this if I can. If we take this one blade right here, and we'll call this the advancing blade, okay? So if the prop is spinning this way, and this is the advancing blade, on the opposite side of it, you have a retreating blade, okay? So the tendency is, is whatever blade is advancing, and it just so happens that all of them are advancing, and all of them are retreating, all at the same time. So we have a very unique situation here. And they're all restrained by this uh, outer hex uh, ring and the outer um, uh, ring that is holding the hex. But so what we have is some um, unique forces which are taking place, okay? And what is called here, and I've written it down, is called the anometer effect. What the anometer effect is this, is that when you have the advancing wing and the re retreating wing, uh, they, they compete against one the other. There's greater lift on the advancing, and then they're on the opposite side at the same simultaneous moment, there is going to be retreating. But as it's retreating, this one is also advancing. So you have this, this back and forth effect that is going to take place um, between the rotors, all the rotors, as they're rotating around. Now, this um, rolling force that is going to take place on each and every one of these wings. So with this one, it'll be opposite of this one. With this one, it'll be opposite of this one. And they're all taking place at the same time. Now, this is going to create a uh, rolling force. And now rolling force is the kind of force, it goes back and forth. And what it wants to do is it wants to flip over oops, the aircraft uh, and, and, and cause it to, to crash, OK? Now, this. Um, the way we've designed the, the prop wing um, is going to compensate for the asymmetry of lift. In other words, this desire to want to flip over um, 